Good morning, everybody. JP and I made it to a stop here. Picking up. Uh, it's a stove and a refrigerator from in here. Sorry, guys, it's chilly this morning. Oh, forgot there was a stair. All right, so we got that in there. And then uh, check out this property, guys. It's got a, a man made pond, which is really cool. And then right over here next to a house is the Rogue River. It's called the Rogue River. But it's not, it's more of a nice little stream. Do a lot of fishing in that stretch of the water. Uh, but yeah, here's a, a man-made pond that we got going on. And then over there in that brick thing over there, that's a bomb shelter. So, me and JP have been here for a little while. We had a water heater in there to disconnect. And uh, we did that. I didn't think it was going to go as easy as it did, but it did. But yeah, it's a bomb shelter. I'll show you guys little sneak peek real quick that's a lot of walking so yeah here's the structure it's crazy oh, there's the pond and then these little holes right here are actually pretty cool I'll show you guys the outside of them right now That goes inside there. Then, a nice little steel door. Did you find something crazy in here? No. Uh, I was thinking, though, are we sure that that one of us going to I mean, the, the, the power is disconnected. Are we sure? That's what he said. But well, now I'm nervous. I'm going to call him here in a minute. Well, you all getting ready to get that wire. Just something. Hey, wait a minute. So this is the bomb shelter. There's the water heater that we, it was sitting up there, but I just disconnected it. Now it's connected to that box. I was told there's no power, no water, no nothing, but there's a light right here. Let's see. Ah, there's power to this. I told you. Don't touch that wire. I told you. I told you. I told you. Right there's the light right yep. there. My brain told me. I was getting ready to touch it. Man, I'm and so I'm glad you didn't, bro. My brain was my, I was getting ready to hit it, and I just looked at the wire. I was like, wait a minute. I, I, I'm following this wire. I said, oh, no. Because that wire come from over here. It's like, no, nah, yeah, bro. We're not touching it. I, as soon as that light came on, that was it for me. If you got power out here, there's power everywhere. No, nah, I ain't messing up. No. I'm glad, man. That's why... I, uh, I mean, I'll follow this extension cord, but God. it's plugged into that wall over there. And here's some more lights. Let's see if these lights come on. No, that light don't come on. But anyway, here's the inside of this bomb shelter. Doesn't look like much right here. But uh, this is what caught our attention. Please do not feed the gator. Do these people really have a gator in their pond back there? There's no fish. But if it was fishing there, it'd be fishing there now. And here is the doorway to the bomb shelter. Come up these steps here. Here as you come in. Concrete walls, steel beams. It's 40 degrees in here. But yeah. So well bomb shelter. And check this out. Remember I just showed you guys a minute ago. A little hole in the wall. See? Right there's the outside. 
So you can sit in here and pluck people off, I guess that's what it is. And then the other one to the outside. It's pretty cool. But my man JP, like I said, there was, we think there's electric to that water here. Because them things are plugged in there. And that light's on. And, uh, yeah, we're not going to deal with that. I was getting ready to hit it, and, and something just said, stop. Wait a minute, bro. This wire is coming from that box. I'm like, nah. Oh, there's not a fuse in it. But it ain't? Uh-uh. Okay. Yeah, we're all right. There's no fuse. Yeah, all right, go ahead. This is okay. Oh, that's that. All right, hang on, guys. I'll put you guys on the... I'm trying to put you guys on the, the, uh, the headlamp here so I can get to this this pipe, but I don't know if this is even going to work. Sorry about all that, guys. It took me a minute to do all that. I'm sorry. My plan is to try to get that pipe loose right there. I might not be able to this toilet on the way. No, oh, that toilet's in the way. I'm not gonna mess with that. I'm not gonna mess with that. The toilet's in the way. I got the water heater out like you asked. Look at the steel plates on there. Yeah, we'll strap that down. Probably wrapped that around a couple of times. Yeah, that's fine. Perfect. Now we were nervous there for a minute because of the power. But without a fuse, it means there's no no electricity to it, so So everyone, we don't just remove appliances from houses and garages. We also remove items from bomb shelters and all kinds of little crazy weird places. You got that? Yep. 
Oh, what's that? Well, that's stuck in the ground. That's good enough right there. I don't see anything else we can take there. I just uh, take the little water heater here. Oh, man, look at this. This is just beautiful. You clean this pond out, all the leaves and all the debris. Man. Sorry right, guys, the video might be a little bouncy. Man, I just love this property. Man. Nice little river flow. There was some tadpoles in that water. We seen them. I don't know if they were tadpoles for, I think they might have been, um, could have been frogs, little tadpole frogs. Cause I don't know, I don't know if there be any fish living in there. I mean, that doesn't get high enough up the bank to flood the uh, pond, so. I don't know. Hey, could you imagine sitting on your deck in the morning? Chairs like that. Having coffee. Looking at the water. And then over here, taking a look at your pond. I gotta go check that. Check that right there. So he said something about there's two water heaters. One was in the bomb shelter, which is over there. And then you know, I don't like walking through here because I don't know what it's like. He said something about by the PVC pipe. Lift it up. And apparently, this must be the ladder here. What in the world? Hold on. There's all kinds of hidden stuff. Ouch. I'm not going to continue. I don't know what's down there. I can't. We're not doing all that. There's just layers and layers and layers of foam. He said there might be a water heater down in there. I don't know. If it is, there's like layers and layers of foam. Foam board. Yeah. And then there's this little ladder right here. I'm saying that's uh I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Huh. I'll give him a shot once we get done with this stuff. He's handling them. I'm trying to get this stove on.
JP's got the dolly with the water heater on it, so I figured I would just kind of walk this one out to the door. But it seems to be a little bit more trickier than I want it to be, but I don't want to. Probably wasn't the most ideal way to do it, but it worked. It was because uh, it's huge right here. Yep. Hey, that worked out perfect. All right, just slide that out of the way, and we'll get this fridge out of here, and then we'll just load everything up together. Hang on, hang on, hang on. All right. Uh-oh. Might have to take the fridge doors off, yep. All right. We gotta bring it back inside a little bit. I'll go get the screwdriver real quick. Sorry if, if, if the video is kind of bouncy. I'm <coughs> just trying to get you guys the best angles. Should just come off. I don't know why it's not. Right there. there it goes. Alright, get this outside. So that one should just pop right off. Now we should be all right. Well, 
hang on, hang up on. Oh, all right, hang on. Okay, now my stuff's outside. Now I'll switch it over to the tripod so you guys don't be getting bouncy.
I'm gonna go lock up. this fixed. Uh, I'm going to have to fix that part down here. Yeah. And then I'm going to get a locking pin. To lock the, the bar behind the, yeah. the hole. I'll probably still keep the bungee on there just because, but I don't know. All right, everybody, as you can see, JP and I got that stuff loaded up. I'm going to head over to Pad Nose real quick. Get it all undone. Probably call it a day. Hope you all have a blessed, wonderful day. See you on the next one.